Welcome to my channel viewers please endeavor to like, share and subscribe, so you will be the first to view latest informations. Former President Donald Trump's first return to Washington DC, due to the fact that leaving workplace final January, has reanimated the backstabby factions inside the MAGA faithful rival corporations, who have spent the time due to the fact his departure planning a way again to power, and who are intent on maintaining others out. The ex-president will be in city on Tuesday to tackle the America First Policy Institute, a fantastically new Trump-aligned nonprofit group, which this week convened endless muggle-loving coverage wonks and loyalists, for a two-day convention in a in-basement blocks away from the Capitol building. The agenda, AFP says, is heavy on legislative desires crafted ahead of what they hope is a Republican return to power in Washington after the midterm elections and beyond. A supply shut to Trump instructed the Daily Beast that despite the cloud of investigations over his head, the former commander-in-chief has been excited about his return to the swamp. The keynote will provide impossibility to current a binary distinction between America below Trump and America below Biden in accordance to the source, who regularly speaks with the ex-president. People are thirsting for solutions this individual said. But simply due to the fact the crew effectively lured Trump return doesn't imply broader Trump world plans to cede authority to them. Instead, ardently pro-Trump sources advise the Daily Beast that FP a nonprofit created quickly after Trump left the White House has become a foe of Mugland. These critics factor to what they see as an ineffectual glitzy employer that has failed to supply tangible victories on behalf of the ex-president while attempting to stake a declare as gatekeeper to a conceivable 2D Trump administration and raking in tens of thousands and thousands of greenbacks in the process. It's a mile extensive and an inch deep, all sizzle, and no substance one modern Trump advisor, who stays in the correct graces of the former president, instructed the Daily Beast. They're burning via donor cash and not doing whatever significant to boost a coherent coverage agenda, and everybody who's paying interest is aware of it. They launched a bunch of centers and unfold way too skinny the very little brain the company has the Trump advisor, who spoke on circumstance of anonymity, continued. The Trump stamp of approval is all they truly have going for them. Likewise, former Trump administration legitimate Peter Navarro instructed the Daily Beast that the pro-Trump Washington DC based team is nothing greater than a Trojan horse that will put Reno Republicans in name only staffers in a second Trump administration and foster the same MISDAKES when it comes to personnel in a doable Trump second term. People are using Trump's true title to defeat him Navarro similarly stated of the incompetent crew of grifter. Trumpism besides Trump coudetted. That commentary didn't sit nicely with AFP's communications chief Mark Lauder, who fired again at Navarro when reached via the Daily Beast. It is unlucky to see Mr. Navarro, a former Hillary Clinton supporter, turning into the DC swamp creature he as soon as abhorred he said. Lauder similarly directed Navarro to go to AFP's website for reams of lookup that construct on the Trump administration's successes, including challenging stances on China and persevering with President Trump's China tariffs. AFP was created closing spring, and with a board loaded with pinnacle Trump White House alums has been billed as something of a White House in waiting. The nonprofit's chair, former Small Business Administration head Linda McMahon, is joined via an array of ex-officials, inclusive of former appearing Homeland Security Secretary Chad Wolf, former Performing Director of Domestic Policy Council Brooke Rollins, and former Monetary Advisor Larry Kudlow. Jared Kushner and Ivanka Trump reportedly serve as casual advisors, according to Axios. Former Florida lawyer customary Pam Bondi and extraordinary White House advisor Kellyanne Conway contribute to the organization's fundraising firepower and there's a